John 14, 6. Jesus says unto him, okay, Jesus speaking. This is red letter. I am the way. That's Jesus, not me. The truth and the life. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. Now what it says, he says, I am the way. It doesn't say I am the church. I am the baptism. I am works. I am doing. I am giving money to charity. That it is the only access. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. So to come to God, you don't come to God as a Baptist, as Catholic, the universal church. You don't get cross-legged and, and jump out of your body. You don't do the yin-yang. You don't give money to charity. You don't feed the poor to come to the Father. Now we're talking about salvation. We're not talking about after salvation. That as far as coming to God to be saved, Jesus said, I am the way. Here it is, right there. I am the way. It didn't say, I am a way. It says, I am the definite article, the way. That's it. Don't care if you're Baptist. I don't care if you're a Baptist writer. I don't care if you're Catholic, the Universal Church. I don't care if you're Presbyterian. I don't care if you're rich. I don't care if you're a Republican. I don't care if you're a Democrat. I don't care what you are. You are not going to come to the Father without the way. And the way is Jesus. Plain and simple. You got it? Proverbs chapter 4 verse 14 Enter not into the path of the wicked and go not the way of evil men so what we saw in John 14, 6 is Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life. Now we find the way of evil men. What is the, the way of evil men? It is the way of join our church. Give money to charity. Feed the homeless. Be baptized. Sprinkle, immerse, open a fire hydrant. Say this prayer. Go to catechism. Do this. Do that. Do anything or don't do nothing at all. The way of an evil man or men is anything but the way, which is Jesus Christ. Now Jesus said, He is the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. That's Jesus. We are warned not to go in the way of evil men. Or the path of the wicked. The evil way of men is the path of the wicked. God is never wicked. So there are two ways. There is the heavenly righteous way of truth and life, Jesus Christ. There is the way of evil men, of wickedness. Out 
outside excluding Jesus. And they lie to you. And there is no life the way of Satan. I move down further, 419. The way of the wicked is darkness. Now go back to verse 14 real quick. Enter not in the path of the wicked. Go not in the way of evil men. The way of the wicked is darkness. So the evil men and the, and the wicked are the same. They know not at which, at what they stumble. One day, you're going to die. And if you have put your trust in the way, the truth, and the life, you'll be absent from this body and present with the Lord. If you have not trusted in Jesus, the way, the truth, and the life, you're going to wake up in hell. And I don't know how long it's going to take to realize there are many people out there going to wake up in hell and not realize, hey, I'm not supposed to be here. All right, the atheist. He deserved hell. But me, I went to church. I gave to charities. I was a good person. I was baptized. I was confirmed. I went and, and confessed to the priest. I was a membership of this church. I was a deacon. I was a pastor. I passed out gospel tracts. I prayed. And you don't realize or didn't realize that what the way you have gone was an absence of the way, the truth, and the life of Jesus Christ. There are many people in church, pastors, Deacon, treasurer, pew sitter, good people. But they did not believe in the way, the truth, and the light. They went the way of darkness. They went the way of wickedness. They went in the way of the evil man. They did not go in the way of truth. They did not go in the way of Jesus prescribed by God. They did not go in the way of light. John says in, in John chapter 3, he says, He that has the Son has the everlasting life. The life. He that has not the Son. You don't have the way. You don't have the truth. You don't have the life shall not see life, but the wrath of God. You see, if it's not God's way, the way, the truth, and life, Jesus Christ, whatever way you call it, it's hell. I've known people, and I know uh, people in the ministry and all that, in churches, and, and come up to this altar or say this prayer. Re repeat this prayer with me. And they were saved, and they died and went to hell. A prayer doesn't save you. Now, I was saved April 25th. I know that I say I was saved on a Saturday in April. The previous Sunday. Sunday before that Saturday, I've gone to, to a Baptist church for the very first time. I heard a message. I was convicted. And Monday or Tuesday, I, I, I called my grandma and I said, you know, 
I gotta talk to somebody. I don't know what's going on. So come Saturday, I sat down with a, with a Christian with a King James Bible. And I knelt down at a coffee table in a living room and I asked Jesus to save my soul. He said, did that prayer save you? What if all actuality if Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, what if at that moment I called on God to, to forgive me and asked him to save and I believed on Jesus before Saturday. I believe in the way and the truth and the life, and I have access to the Father. It may not have been Saturday. I dealt with men at the prison who, who have gone under conviction. You say, is it that moment that, well, they came forward and they, and, and they knelt down in you, no, it may have been when they were sitting in the seat and God was working on their heart. They may have already said to God, I believe, I believe. I got With the heart, man believes unto righteousness. You go forward and you bow down in front of somebody and you or you say, hey, listen, I'm, I'm saved. With the heart, man believes unto righteousness, salvation. With the mouth, confession is made unto salvation. Hey! That prayer may be just, hey, I'm, hey, I, with my heart, I believe. Ah, I can't shut up. I gotta tell somebody. That's one of the main things of, of knowing somebody's saved. Do they go tell others? I was Saturday. I knelt down and asked Jesus to save me. Sunday morning, I went to church, raised my hand, said, "Yeah, I believe in Jesus." Yesterday, which would have been Saturday. After church, we made an arrangement with the pastor to, to get baptized and all that. I went home the next Sunday. Saturday, I would say, the next Sunday after church, I went home and told my dad that he was going to hell. With my heart, I have believed on salvation. With my mouth, I had to go tell somebody. I believed in the way, the truth, and the light. I have access to the Father. I didn't believe in the church I went to. I didn't go to believe in the church I was in before that. I was a Catholic, Roman Catholic. That didn't do nothing for me. Good works? Not me before I was saved. Uh, chapter 14. Chapter 14, verse 12. There is a way which seemeth right unto man. But the end, the end, not the way, a way, the end, there are the ways of death. So what's that one? That's religion. That's science. That's education. That's anything but Jesus Christ, the way, the truth, and the life. This is Satan, chapter 14, verse 12. Satan does not give us affirmative, direct article of the. Satan will offer a. You want to go in the realm of science? There you go. You want to go in the realm of, of evolution? There you go. You want to go the way of religion? I've got plenty of religions for you to choose from. You don't want to believe in anything? You want I've got atheism. What are all those ways? The wages of sin, those ways, not the way, not the truth, not the life, a way, or the way of an evil man, or the way of the wicked, is sin. It kills you. And since it's sin and not of God, you don't go to the Father. 
Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and life. No man cometh unto the Father. You die in the death and burial and resurrection of Jesus. Faith and belief in Jesus, the Lamb of God, which take away the sin of the world. You will be absent from the body and present with the Lord, standing before God. Jesus says, I'm the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father. You ain't going to the Father without Jesus. If ever, it's not going to happen. But if I ever show up at the, at the pearly gates of heaven, why should I let you in? The blood of Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ suffered and died and was buried and rose again the third day according to the scriptures. The angel said, he's not here, he's not risen. Jesus died for me. He's my Lamb of God which takes away the sin of the world. Come on in. But if you come a way, it brings forth death. I was a Baptist. I was a first Baptist. I was a second Baptist. I was a third Baptist. I was congregational. I was Catholic. I was Presbyterian. I was a Jehovah Witness. I was... Go ahead. Name any religion. Pick any religion. Pick any of the millions of gods of India. Go Islam. Go New Age. Wicca. E Eastern mythicism. Go into to reaching out to the universe. The dragon. The Hubble. Going to the moon. Going to the Mars. Going to evolution. Look for the dinosaurs. Look for the fossils. Be a good person. Treat everybody right. Let your light shine. Be friendly. Don't get upset. Be meek. Do unto others as others have done unto you. Go help the poor. Get money to the poor. Make food bags for the poor. Give money to charity, the dial a thon, and, and whatever charity to give them. Do a way that is not the way. And the end of your way, a way, whatever way it is, not the way. The end of that way, the way of death, the end. See, a way leads to the end and death. The way of Jesus Christ ends to the way, the truth, the life, the Father. Did you notice that? 16. Two. All the ways... Not the way, the ways, plural. Are clean. All the ways of man are clean in his own eyes. I'm a good person. God would love me. Surely God will be pleased with me. I met the few people in my time. That they actually, when they gone to church, sat down, and they're like, God is pleased I'm here today. Yeah, I met a couple of them. The fact is that God showed up in church. That, that lit up all heaven. God will allow me into heaven because I'm black. Black lives matter. God will allow me into heaven because I'm a great doctor. People will believe that uh, good people will end up in heaven. You don't get to heaven by being good. 
You get to heaven by the way, the truth, and the life. The Sister Teresa. Everybody puts her as a good woman. But her goodness will not get her into heaven. And if she's never put her, I don't know, listen to me, I don't know. But if she put her faith in the way, Jesus, in the truth and in the life, she's in heaven today with, with, the, with the Father. Not because she was a Catholic, not because she went on the missionary field, but because of Jesus. There are men and women, they are saved by the way, the truth, and the life, and they've gone to foreign missions. And are in going to or are in heaven today. And there are men and women who don't even go to church no more. They too put their faith and trust in the way, the truth, and the life. They'll die and go to the Father, even if they skipped out. If Demas followed the way, the truth, and the life, he's in heaven. As much as Paul, who followed the way, the truth, and the life, he's in heaven. And we're not going to talk about crowns and judgments and all that. We're not talking about that. Good people are in hell. Baptists are in hell. People who help and feed the homeless are in hell. Republicans and Democrats are in hell. That neighbor that helped his neighbor who couldn't do things without the way, the truth, and the life, he is in hell. Though he did good. There are, listen, I'm a street preacher many years, and one of the biggest things people would come up to me while I was preaching, or holding a sign, I'm good. I say, well, you're not good enough. The Bible says there is none that do as good, no, not one. How can you be, or how can you do what the Bible says you can't? It says, but the Lord's way is the Spirit. There's a judgment day coming. Everything that man and devil in the world can think of to make you think you're going to a utopia, to a paradise, to a heaven, reincarnation, outer space, whatever it is, that Satan offers his people their religion, whatever happy land, can I say that? They are not going by the ways of man. Listen, religion is man made, Jesus Christ is God approved. Okay? That's it. I don't care if you're a Mason. I don't care if you were the President of the United States. I don't care what your position is at the corporation. I don't care if your race has been deprived and battered and abused. I don't care if you were a slave or a slave owner. Poor in a ghetto or rich in a mansion. When you die, you're going to be absent from this body and present with the Lord through the way, the truth, and the life, the access to the Father, through Jesus Christ alone. If you have the ways, a way, the way of wickedness, the way of evil men, 
You will die in your sins and you'll wake up in hell. You will be shocked in hell who is there with you. Yes, the prostitutes will be there, the drug pushers, the child molesters, out of Hitler, but the rich dignitary, the priests, the pastors, the person that lived in that rich building, the founder of all those hospitals, the doctor that cared for all the people. Oh, that friendly nurse. Oh, the, 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 the person they, they put on the television. They're at every food kitchen. He does the telephone. He does this. He puts on, a, you know, for a homeless. He puts on for the people who, who have been stranded by this hurricane. He puts on this for somebody who needs help. Uh, he, you know, he helps, he helps, he does, he helps, he does. He does great works. He belongs to this church. Oh, he, he's got this degree in his local club, and, and he's the president of this, and, and, he, no, but, and he was a great father. He was, she was a wonderful mother. They were great children. Oh, this wonderful, great person without the way, without the truth. Without the life, you cannot get to the Father, you'll be in hell. And the day of the rapture, you will be also surprised to see who's in the clouds when the church is raptured. Her, she was a prostitute. Yeah, but she put her faith and trust in Jesus. Yeah, it was the gardener. Yep, and he put his faith and trust in Jesus. Yeah, it was a homeless man who put his faith and trust in Jesus. He was an owner of a grocery store who put his faith and trust in Jesus. Whoever is in the clouds in the day of the rapture, whether dead or alive, whoever are in the clouds are ones that said, Jesus is the way. He is the truth. He is the light. You know, you can be saved and be in a Catholic church. You can be saved and don't go to church. Billy Sunday was saved and did not have any association with any church. Check out Moody with his church. The Booth, Salvation Army. They had women preachers. I know, a minute, I know a missionary team, evangelists, they preach on the streets. The men preach and the women preach. Okay, what are you going to do? That's not my judgment. Okay, what about that woman preacher there you know, on the street? Does she believe in the way, the truth, and the life? I had an argument with one person today about Donald Trump. I said, listen, Donald Trump is rich. He's famous. Prideful. Arrogant, and he comes. Oh, well, what you can't say he can't get saved? I didn't say that. If Donald Trump now or ever will put his faith and trust in the way, the truth, and the life, he will stand before the Father. Realize the laws that go to the judgment, I mean, goes to the great white throne judgment, they don't stand before God. They stand before the Lord Jesus Christ. No lost man is going to see God. The judge that sits on the great white throne judgment is Jesus. If President Joe Biden, if the faith he believes, whatever the actions he does, along with President or ex-president, what do you say? Obama, Bush, Clinton, Carter, I'm missing any presidents that have been alive. If their faith is in the way, the truth, and the light, whatever they did, whatever they didn't do, 
if it is in Jesus, the way, the truth, and the life, they will die and be with the Father. Now, if they believed in other things, the ways of man, the way of the wicked, the way of the evil man, the ways of darkness, they will die in their sins and go to hell. It's that simple. A pope can go to heaven by the way, the truth, and the life. Or the Pope can go to hell by believing he is the way. He is the eternal Father. Verse 25. There is a way that seemeth right unto man, but the end thereof is the way of death. Now here we go, it's repeated. I'll give money to something. No Jesus. Death and hell. I'll be the greatest employee. I will help my co-workers. Whatever help they need. I will go above and beyond for my, my boss and my employer. If you do it without Jesus. You'll die and go to heaven. I will go to this church. I will be a member of this church. I will tithe to this church. I will pick up papers and gum off the floor of this church. And if you do it without Jesus, you'll go to hell. I'll become a deacon. And I'll help the pastor. And I'll help the people. And you do it without Jesus, you'll die and go to hell. I'll sit in a pew. Not much I can do. But Jesus, you're, you're my faith. Jesus, it is you that died for me. Jesus, to you I, I confess my sins. And ask the Father to cleanse and to forgive me. That nobody will die and be absent from the body in presence of the Lord. That homeless man, he's out of money. He's out of fortune. He's out of family. He's out of work. He doesn't have much. Whatever he has, it could be stolen by the other homeless. He sleeps on the ground. He gets wet by the weather. But he has bowed the knee. And he has put his faith and trust in Jesus. There's nothing else in his life but Jesus. His sins have been washed by the Lamb of God. He will die and be absent from the body in the presence of the Lord. You see, there, in the way of God, there is the way. Let's go back to John 14. There is the way. There is the truth. There is the light. And it's through Jesus. And through Jesus, the way, the truth, and the life, you come to the Father. And coming to the Father is by me. Jesus, not me. You can have a way. Whatever it is. Whether it be the realm of education, science, religion, 
good deed, whatever it is, you can have a way and die and go to hell. You can have the way, plural. You could be a scientist and a religionist, and you could be a theistic evolutionist. And you could die and go to hell. The city council, the city people may put you up on high. This is a great person. Look at the great things they have done. Whether it be a, a way or the way. And die and go to hell. That good Samaritan, he ran to, to take that family out of the car that was going to blow up. He rescued her out of the burning building. He went out there and grabbed them from the floodwaters. That's good. But if it's a way or no way, they're still going to die. Without the way, the truth, and the light, there is no coming to the Father. When you have put your faith and trust in Jesus, what must I do to be saved? Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ. And that's how be saved. Now watch. The way, the truth, the light. The Father. Acts 16, 31. Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ. Okay. Titus. Thirteen. Looking for that blessed hope, the glorious appearing of our, of the great God and our Savior, Lord Jesus Christ. That great God and the Savior, Lord, Lord Jesus Christ. Duh. That's the same. Jesus is God. So you can be wonderful, and you can be great. And you can do good. And you still can go to hell. There are great, wonderful, good people in hell. Don't be surprised. The ones that don't go to hell are those that come to Jesus by faith and belief alone as the way, the truth, and the light that they might come to the Father. So when they die, they'll be absent from the body and be present with the Lord. Don't mess with Bible words. Keep the words exactly as they are. 